but true, we leave Horton to listen and zoom in on who. But guess who enters the story now? Who? You! Need a tiny little family on a small rainy day. Mom and Dad are just home from the Who PTA. And here's their son, Jojo. In trouble again. The disease taking places where no one has been. I'm the mayor of Who. Why, I've just been elected. And upright behavior is thus forth expected. Well, we just had a talk with your teachers today, and they didn't have one single good thing to say. You invented new things which defy all description. You gave me so duly a nervous conniption. Your things were so wild, they disrupted your classes, and made Mrs. Mackle who drop her new glasses. <laughs> which is why you're suspended. Yes, that's what they said. Young man, what in who has got into your head? Well, well, I, 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 I... Now, Morton is found. We're safe on a clover, but clearly our troubles are far, far from over. We don't mean to scold you. Do you love me? Oh well, yes, dear, but couldn't you just try thinking a bit less, dear? Stop telling such outlandish tales. Stop turning minnows into whales. <laughs> now take your bath and go to bed. And, and think, think some normal, normal things instead. instead. Have a think in that tub. Think of water and fish. Fish? Think of pipes in the floor. Running out to a shore where the water is cool. Soon your tub's not a tub. It's McGilligan's pool. This might be a pool like I've read of in books. Connected to one of those underground brooks. An underground river that starts here and flows. Right under the bathtub, and then who knows it's possible. Anything's possible. It might go along down where no one can see. Where under the highway 203. Right under the wagons, right under the toes of Mrs. Abruzzo, who's hanging out clothes.
it's possible. Anything's possible.